Hello everybody, my name is Finnick Flyer and welcome back to episode 20 of my Pokemon Emerald Hardcore Gorilla Log. Brought to you with a few changes. The probably most notable and obvious of which being the face cam on the screen and the next of which being the death counter and the run counter that I will be keeping up with from now on. But hopefully this run counter isn't going to be changing until the series is over. Hopefully, we'll see. Um, but anyway, hello, thank you, um, for coming and stopping by, I guess, let's see our starters, um, okay, Silcoon, good early game Pokemon, you know, um, Kabuto, okay, that's like Clint, Clint's coming back, and a Poochyena, hmm, so we have a Silcoon, a Kabuto, and a Poochyena. I don't think I'm gonna choose Kabuto. I'd kind of like to. I feel like out of these three, Kabuto is my favorite of these three Pokemon, but the level up moveset was not good at all. Um, Silcoon, gonna be really tough to get strong enough to attack anything because I'm gonna get a level five and then... I don't know if I'm gonna have much. And then Poochyena, dark type Pokemon. But we're about to be going against the there's the fighting type gem, and Silcoon would be really helpful for that if we still have it by then. And Poochyena would not. Um, I think I'm gonna go. And Silcoon's gonna you're gonna learn absorb. I think I'm gonna go Silcoon, and then I'm gonna. Just see what I can do for. Loving up. What's the. Wait. Oh, yeah, because I'm using her candies in this, so it should be okay. You only have hardened right now. I'll be right back. Okay, so. Apparently? I'm probably just gonna play that battle sped up instead of skipping it because I figured I would just like, you know, pass out and then skip it or maybe I would get lucky and it would just spam like growl or tail over something the whole time and I'd somehow be able to take it out with struggle. But um, I didn't know that if you get too low in that battle it runs away from you, but that Zigzagoon just ran away from me when I was at 2 HP. So I guess we're good, we didn't lose our Pokemon. I was sitting here thinking like, okay, am I gonna use this like until you get your Pokeballs, or just like, straight up, if I die, I die, because I don't know, but I guess we don't have to worry about that. Okay, so Silcoon, nickname, I'm gonna name you Derek, because I want to. So there we go, Derek the Silcoon. Okay, and... Um, let's see how we go. Once we get to the town, I'm gonna get the rare candy cheat running and see if that's gonna work. Oh wait, I'm not supposed to come in here. I forgot again. Forgot again. Okay, just a minute. I need to fix some of the controls. Okay, hello. While I was gone, I did go ahead and hopefully get the rare candy cheat working. So we'll see what that's like when we get to the Pokemart. Whatever. Okay. So jump bluff. We're not counting dupes claws between runs, are we? I presume. Let's run until we get up there and see what we can do. I want to say I want to be careful when leveling up because I don't want to kill anything, but also I need to attack stuff anyway. I don't want to die. Okay, so let's take a look-see at this. Phoenix items, withdraw, rare candies. I want more than one. Um, let's get 40, there we go. And what's the level cap? I think it's 12. Okay, so I just checked and our level cap for Roxane is level 15, which is honestly very good for our situation here. So let's go ahead, level up and evolve our Silcoon here. But first, 
just out of curiosity, I want to see what item you have, and I want to see a super repel. Okay, cool. That could come in handy. Um, and I want to see... Oh yeah, speed boost! I forgot your ability is speed boost. I saw that when we getting when you get some of the jump bluffs. Okay. Bro, I kind of hope it I kind of hope it stays the same. I just hope that it's fine when it evolves. Okay, so let's see what this evolution is gonna be. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well, I mean, we know the evolution is going to be beautiful, but like, I, I don't know. See the ability? I don't know what I was saying when I did that. Learned my lesson? I'm not doing the beat to any more evolution music, like, ever in my life. Don't quote me on that. Beautifly! And there we go. Absorb. Very necessary. I'm going to be very helpful. So I'm just going to wait. I'm going to leave you... A level 10 right now and shield dust so that could be helpful that could be helpful honestly I'm fine with that and let's see what we can get over here I forgot what level the rivals Pokemon is gonna be. An Electabuzz. Okay, I'll take that, I'd take that. I feel like we're gonna be fine at level 10 though. I don't wanna get too over leveled. I also forgot what you're gonna have. So we had the, we chose the one in the middle, which is typically gonna be, I don't know. I wanted honestly say that she's gonna have Mudkip, but I don't know, that's probably just wishful thinking. Let's just go at it, let's see. We don't have Pokeballs yet, so it's fine. And I'm level 10. They're not expecting someone to be level 10 right now. She's probably level 7. I think. If I remember right. Boss Pie, I love that. Oh, look, it's just level 5, and it is Mudkip. Okay. Bro, I love that. Our rival's name is Boss Pie. So this ROM is the same randomization as the last time, the time I did it correctly. All the opponent's Pokemon are the same Pokemon, same level of moveset, everything. All the moves and everything are the same. Evolution's the same and whatever. Um, but abilities are randomized because I'm going to beat it. I'm going to. So there we go. Mudkip down. And we've defeated Boss Pie. Could not have done that as a Silcoon. and I could not have. I think I'm honestly liking our odds right now. With this Beautifly. Because Beautifly is probably one of the best, like, early game Pokemon to get right now. Um, I'm speeding up. Because the Flying type and then the Absorb. Obviously, I need to be careful because Rock is still super effective against me. So, I'm going to have to be very careful about that. Um, but... I think we still got it. We're gonna have other Pokemon by then, you know. Now we have Pokeballs. So let's go look. Let's see, let's go speak to our mum. Please give me running shoes. I wanna go fast. We go super speedy. We got speed up. Okay, so, um, let's go. Yeah, it's jump, jump Bluff. I wonder what the other, Jump Bluff's the only one we've, gotten so far an absorb to a jump bluff isn't gonna kill it no it's not okay yeah i'm keeping speed up on until synthesis only has 5 pp i think only 15 can I get you into yellow? Okay. Hmm.
I'm not gonna get you into red before you use synthesis again. Come on. Use synthesis. Okay, I'm... There's still two other routes to go on to. Jump off is a flying and grass type. I'm a flying type, I have absorb. And I'm just gonna kill my chances of getting any of the other Pokemon. Cause I'm not sure if we're gonna catch it with two more Pokeballs. And all of this stuff. So I'm gonna, cause I remember Emerald is always super difficult for money in the beginning of the game. It was always my main issue. Money, money, money. And I don't know how much money I have right now actually. So I'm going to run. You're gonna be the first not a jump off, aren't you? No, but still a jump off. Why did we, we ran into more than just one Pokemon last time, didn't we? All I can remember is the Bulbasaur with wing attack or aerial ace or whatever it was. I think it was wing attack from like the first, first run that was already, it was just messed up from the beginning, messed up from the start because I had already randomized it and then I just re-randomized and already randomized drawn, which wasn't the best. Hmm. Well, I don't know. Let's see how much money we do. Let's see how many Pokeballs we can get. Oh my gosh. Hello! Yes, I will come with you. Do you give me a potion? You do give me a potion. Thank you for the potion. Hello, I would like to buy Pokeballs. I have enough Pokeballs. I have enough money. Oh yeah, I have. I could have. I could have done it. I'm gonna get 25. Yes. And oh yeah, I always forget about the Premier Balls. I should have bought 10 and 10 and 5. Um, three, four antidotes. And. Two paralyzed heals, two awakenings, four outside of battle. It's just, I remember starting a battle asleep is not very good to do. Four outside of battle, don't worry. Um, Electabuzz is here. I'm kind of scared of that, so I'm just gonna go into the unknown and hope that it's not as scary as an Electabuzz. Please let me catch you. Okay. Totodile! It's Dylan! Dylan, Dylan, Dylan. Okay. If you don't know, um, Luke and Dylan, Pat and Vinny, the boys, they're other YouTubers, bigger YouTubers who I watch. Wait, is that gonna do. Oh, I did not think that through. And then I did it, and I was like, wait, I'm level 10! <laughs> oh, wait a minute, I didn't think of that. <laughs> um, it's okay, it's cool, we got it, we got it, we got it. Uh, let's see. Okay, second Pokeball. Come on, Dylan! Please! Please! I physically can't do anything else. Game Boy Luke. No. No. Come on, dude. I physically can't do anything else to you. 
I physically can't. Do you want a premier ball? Do you want a premier ball, sir? Ooh, that looked fancy. Gibble. I thought it was gonna work. I thought it was gonna work. Oh my gosh. Come on, buddy, buddy boy. Please. 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 Okay. 22. Go my defense again. But the last scratch didn't do much. I'm gonna go ahead and graze my defense. This guy kills me with a crit at this point. He kills me with a crit, but I want him so bad. I'm gonna do the smart decision and run away. Cause I was at 15, then I was at 10. Okay. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. We just didn't get a totodile. That was our red HP for the entire battle. Well, I know what my intro moment's gonna be. Friggin'. This is why you pay attention. Using absorb from a level 10 on a level 4. Ah. I don't like this controller as much as my other one. Look at me blaming the controller. Rah, rah, rah. Um, yeah, why not? That's a bad idea. It's a very bad idea. I'll buy potions at the next town. I probably shouldn't have done this yet. I probably should come back to this route. Yeah, it's an Electabuzz. Hello, Electabuzz. Hi. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Cool. We got an Electabuzz. We got an Electabuzz. When a storm approaches, it competes with others to scale heights that are likely to be stricken by lightning. Sometimes use Electabuzz in place of lightning. Hello? Who are Google's main competitors? What are you- Hello? No. I'm not- I'm not asking for Google's competitors. Anyway. <laughs> Sometimes use Electabuzz in place of lightning rods. <laughs> okay, so... I'm gonna name you Zeke. Again, I guess just because I want to. There's some Pokemon that I have like specific names for. These are not them so far. Okay, so let's go heal. Very glad that we have a second team member. Ayy. Thank you. Restored health. And I'm going to... Oh, check abilities. Summary. Immunity. Okay, we have another immunity. Hey, <laughs> and it's electric, so it's like light. Look at that. Look at that. I am ecstatic right now. Both that we have it and that it didn't use it on us. You're level 3, so I don't know how much it would have done, but it might have done something. Okay, so let's go ahead and get you to... And then see what the first trainer's like. 
because I forgot what levels they're at. Smile. Come at me, boy. I am an official Pokemon trainer. I apparently, yeah, apparently it's law that I can't say no to your challenge, but I mean, I can try. <laughs> I can sneak around you. Weightlifter Tia with the Poochiano. Let's. I need to switch that. I need to put Absorb first. Okay, so there's level five. So my level six, being at level six should be fine. Oh, I didn't put it to, I forgot to change everything at the start. Um, first thing I'm gonna do is go to Pokemon, go to summary, go to put Harden first, and then I'm going to go down here and put Thunder Punch, Leer than Quick Attack, yeah, there we go. And then now I'm going to go to the options and do all these things. A battle scenes on set. What do I want? This is what I used to do, at least sometimes as a kid, this one, 19. But I'm gonna do 14. That's nice, I like that. And it adds a little bit of different color to the layout, because I know that the layout's very green until we get our first Pokemon. Um, so, I like that, I like that a lot. I don't know if I've ever used that one. So let's send out Zeke and see what you're gonna do. Haha, <laughs> our eyes have met. Wormful. Tell me what you guys think about that border. Tell me if you like it or if you think it's whatever. You know? So I don't know. I like it. It's definitely very like there. It's like there. It's like pops. I'm not gonna like that. <laughs> oh yeah, no more. Oh yeah, it's intimidate Zigzagoon. It's no more sunny day Zigzagoon. Okay, I'm level seven now. And an Intimidate Tableau. Interesting. Okay, so let's see. Whoop. Whoop. I'm gonna try to not battle any other trainers. Sorry, if you can, if you don't, in case you don't notice me going up and down and up and down and up and down in just, just like that. Um, yeah. I used to be like tech savvy. When I was literally, no joke, like, 10? Oh, you turn. When I was like 10? And then it just all went away. Something happened and it just all went away. So, yeah, I'm, I've been defeated by my attempts to make the joystick on this controller work. I'm just using like the up, down, left, right, like buttons right now. Ah, uh, and it's interesting. Doesn't what does Enigma do? Doesn't Enigma? A oh, Lapras, cool. I'm running. Um, doesn't Enigma like raise one of any stat, or does it raise multiple? I don't know. Let's heal real quick and check. That's not where I check. Bag berries. Oh, it's a Pokeblock ingredient. I must have just seen it on Draft League stuff. I'm in a Pokemon Battle Draft League and it's really cool. We're about to start the next season and I'm super hyped. Ah, get out my way, dude. Thank you. And let's see. Hello, yes, it is me, Finnick. Hello, Wally. What Pokemon are you going to catch today? I forgot what you call last time. Wasn't it a Snorlax? Wasn't, weren't we talking about the Snorlax and then it was just like, oh, hey, yeah, it's me. I have the Snorlax. It's a Mankey. Oh, Arlene! And you're the Smoochum. The emotions that I just went through there were too intense. Bro, what you gonna catch with one Pokeball besides a Mankey and maybe last time a Snorlax, apparently? I guess it's just you. You need one Pokeball. There we go. Um... Yep, let's go to Rustboro City. Hello, Scott. 
Um, Grosper City, Grosper City, I think. I'm gonna leave a little bit of something for the very beginning of next episode. I think this episode, it's been a few minutes. I'm going to end this episode off right here and in front of this water with this funny old reflection. And next episode, first thing we'll do is we'll get the next encounter in the route across. So, thank you all so much for coming and watching this video. I really appreciate it. Um, if you liked the video, you know, feel free to subscribe, hit the like button if you liked it, or dislike button if you didn't. Uh, tell me how you're feeling in the comment section below. And question of the day today, it's a new run of the series, you know, new things going on. What do you think our chances are looking like so far in the series? I know we just started, but I mean, what do you think we're gonna do? How far do you think we're gonna get? Give an estimate for what gym or what gym leader or... If you just think I'm gonna make some stupid mistake against some random trainer and just completely collapse in on myself. Let's see what's going on. So thank you all so much for watching. I really pre appreciate all you being here and I hope you all have a good day. Goodbye.